So today uh, in this video, we'll talk about that, how we can find out the sensitivity of the soil. So let's discuss that, how we can find out the sensitivity of the soil. Sensitivity of soil. So, sensitivity of the soil is the ratio of unconfined compressive strength of the soil at undisturbed sample, undisturbed sample to the unconfined compressive strength at remolded or disturbed sample. So the ratio of both of these values is known as the sensitivity of the values. The greater the ratio of this, uh, these two values, the greater the problematic soil will be. So it can be further explained as if the if the stress strain curve of undisturbed sample is like that and the stress strain curve of remolded sample will be like that stress versus strain behavior of undisturbed undisturbed and disturbed or remolded sample so the difference be between these two or the ratio of undisturbed to disturbed sample of unconfined compressive strength is regarded as the sensitivity. The more the, this gap is greater will be the sensitivity, greater will be the ratio of both of these values and more will be the problematic soil or more will be the sensitive uh, uh, the soil. So in the literature, you can find out the allowable range of sensitivity of the soil. If the sensitivity of the soil is more than two, it can be classified as low sensitive soil. And if it is more than four and eight, then it will be highly sensitive soil. But you can find out the exact values in the literature corresponding to which you can classify the sensitivity of the soil. So this is how we can define the sensitivity of the soil. 